All right, I'm on hole number four of the Celtic Cup tournament. I'm in the opening round of the rookie division. Let's go to, we can't go to Golf Clash Notebook because they don't have anything up. Sorry about that. Let's make sure we got everything we want. Hole number four, this is a par three. So I'm either gonna be using my backbone or my Saturn. And I'm gonna start off with I'm going to start off with a nav just because it'll help cut the wind down. But I have no idea. I can't remember what the hole looks like. I'm really, really bad at that. I, I, I played so I played these holes in golf class so many times I don't even remember the names of them. Somebody, my teammate, one of my teammates will call me and go, "Oh yeah, I'm talking about this hole right here," and I'm like, "I have no idea," so I have to pull it up and look at it and go, "Oh yeah, I remember that hole." <laughs> So I am going to have to hit it from back over here on this side right here. Which is not my preferred way to come at these par 3's. My preferred way to come at par 3's is to get as close to the green as you possibly can. Sometimes you have to do these little bounce over shots. And those bounce over shots in many cases are your best chance for a hole in one. But it's so easy, and our opponent is going to end up in the rough on their drive because they didn't take the wind out, and they're right up against the, right up against the fringe. Or the transition. Okay, so where are we in my club? There's Max Club. There's me, Minimum. So we're about mid club right here. Just a little teeny bit of top spin on it. Three eight. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> so a full ring adjustment's about two and a half rings. We're in mid club, so I should actually do less than that. But I'm just gonna do a full ring adjustment. My goal here today is just to find out what it's going to take to get on these holes and then I can start trying to worry about dialing it in. I'm really focused today on the right club, the right ball, and because I have limited ball guide, making sure that I'm coming at the green with the right top spin, back spin, combo, whatever it needs to be. And then I can start really trying to focus on making good wind adjustments, especially for those mids or minimum wind adjustments. The goal today is just to get on the green, see what it's going to take to get up there. And these par fives, if you got lower developed clubs, are going to be a challenge. You're going to have to execute perfect and you're going to have to bring the right clubs. And I dropped a shot on hole number three messed up the drive so now I'm behind the eight ball I don't like dropping shots I like picking shots up and hanging on to them all right that was hole number four of the Celtic Cup tournament in the Monday qualifying round of the rookie division thanks for watching